Oh, hey, hey YouTube. Um, I'm doing another review today, but this one's just gonna be strictly games. I'm not gonna do any other surprises. Um, it's it's just gonna be one game, and it's like I think it's a good game, but I know a lot of people don't agree with me. So I'm just gonna get my opinions out there on it. Um, I got it when I was when I was little, like younger than I am now, and I got it with my little brother, and we played it a lot. Um, and it had like two player, like we could both play. And I mean that was that's a lot of fun and all. I like that. Uh, I didn't like playing it by myself. Like I I'd rather had my little brother there. Um, but the game is Army Men Sarge's Heroes by 3DO. Um, it's it's a lot of fun. Why well, I liked it because you play as Army Men or an Army Woman, and she's the only one that's not green. I don't know why. I don't think they wanted to color her green for like sex appeal and stuff. I mean I get it, but. I kind of wanted to see her with green skin. Um, you like play as the army men, and you go around in your house and stuff. And there's like cool levels, because there was like in your house. Well, I mean not your house, but like a house. And the one level that I really liked, there's one in a bathtub, and you could play as the army men, like going around the bathtub. And it was a lot of fun because me and my little brother used to have the army men. We had our own army men, like in real life, and we would set them up on our bathtub, so I can like relate. Um, it has 3D. We never got it to work. Uh, I think you needed one of the special TVs. Um, but we didn't get the 3D to work, but it's still, I mean, it's a pretty solid game. There's like, you can use guns and rubber ducks and stuff. Uh, I think the same people that worked on Crash Bandicoot worked on this game. Um, I'm not 100% positive on that. You can double check me. But, um, I, I liked it. I liked how you could, they're always green. Like, because green's my favorite color, honestly. Um, so you didn't have to worry about, like, swapping to different colors and stuff. You always had your favorite one. And the green one was my favorite. Uh, besides her. But once again, they just didn't want to make her green. Uh, the only bad things I have to say about it is um, the game, it didn't always work. Like, when I put in my Nintendo, I would have to blow in it a lot. Like that. And it didn't always work. Like, we would try and to get it to work forever, and it wouldn't. So we usually just ended up playing another game. But um, that was that was bad. But uh, other than that, everything was perfect. Um, the controls were tight. The graphics were good. The colors were good. Um, well, the 3D didn't always work, but... I mean, it's good. I, I'd check it out. Uh, you might have to pull out your old Nintendo and find the cords and stuff for it. Uh, but I already had mine because I was playing another game, so I just pulled this game out and I was playing again just like old times, um, kicking it back, um, having fun, blasting some fools. <laughs> it was good. Uh, check it out if you're into these types of games, if you're into like small toy soldiers and stuff. Um, like I love the movie Small Soldiers also, so that's really cool that they made a game off of it. Um, but... Uh, I think that's about it. That's all I have to say about it, really. Um, just try not to play as her, too, because she's got really low health, and you don't want to play as her. But, um, I mean, it's good.